<laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Nico from Dwarf Games. This is the Binding of Isaac. Wrath of the Lamb. Um, so we're just gonna jump right in because you probably, maybe, possibly know what this game is about. If you don't, basically, this kid Isaac has like a super religious mom and she hears the voice of God and she tells him to or he tells her to murder him Isaac that is tell God tells his mom to murder Isaac so she's coming after him and he's trying to hide from her so we're just gonna jump right in here and uh these are the controls right here. No, I don't want you to die, Isaac. Uh, let's see. There we go. That's better. Now, uh, this stuff here is poop. And you shoot it. Sometimes it'll drop something for you. Uh, the enemies are like flies, I guess. Um, and I think his bullets are tears, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, a key. What? Uh, infestation. Um, so I guess now he's, like, fat and green. Okay. Interesting. So Isaac is now fat and green. Okay. Ah. What? Ah. No. Ah. So you push Q to take pills. Oh, tears up. So I guess we can shoot faster, possibly. And we push E to drop bombs. And those, that blue rock there is a tinted rock, and they usually drop things. So there it dropped the little blue heart and a key. The blue hearts are called spirit hearts, and they're like, I guess, temporary health, sort of. If you look up in the top left, there's a mini map. Probably should have pointed that out earlier, but ah, a little red heart there too. Great. Um, so I guess now we're just gonna have to go fight the boss. Cause I mean, what else do you do? That that's really all you can do is fight the boss. And win. So this guy is Larry Jr. He's just like a worm thing. He drops poop all over the place. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Ha ha. So then, like, I guess every time you hit him, he loses a, one of his little balls. Or something. Oh god. Oh 
Come here. No, 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 no. And then he drops, like, health. And then there's always, like, an item. Like a boss item, I guess. So that one's Mom's Coin Purse. I guess it just drops a bunch of pills. I found pills and ate them. Oh dear, what? Oh, the secret room. There's, I guess, a secret room in every level. If you can find it, there's like coins and stuff in there. So that's fun. Um, yeah. And since we've already defeated, defeated the boss, then we don't have to get him again. So another cheers up pill. And speed up. So now we are. No, I don't want to die, Isaac. So now we're. If you look here, we're faster. And we shoot faster, too. And just down we go to the basement 2. Just gonna skip that little cutscene. Oh dear. This is a self-sacrifice room. We go in here and get some stuff. Full health. Telepills. In the secret room, we just picked up a nickel. That was that little black thing. Uh, yeah. Oh dear. Yeah, so every time you go through those little spiky tooth doors, you lose some health. Ooh, that's fun. Eyeless babies. Something. I don't know. But we got a key. So that's all good. Lots of headless people. Um, so those people are fun. Anyway, yeah. So I got the Binding of Isaac uh, a few days ago during the Steam sale, the summer Steam sale, which is still going on. Um, if you don't have Steam. I don't really know what's wrong with you. No offense if you don't have Steam. Uh, but... Steam is great. That was nice, we just got a bomb back, as well as our... Spirit Heart. Was we got to. And there's a, a boss room, and an item room, and a secret room in every level. This bomb here. Wait, what? What? Okay. It's this book of shadows. Hmm. That was a waste of time. Huh. Things I think are called human popcorn. Come on. Can I just get a regular bomb? Uh, those things aren't very fun, because you have to run over them. They take, like, a whole heart of health, and then you have a chance of getting an item. So, very risky. Of course, if you're a professional player or whatever, uh, then I suppose you could do that, but I'm not. I mean, I've played it a little bit, but 
I'm not that great. This guy's pretty easy. He's the Duke of Flies. He just floats around and spits flies everywhere. Nothing too bad. Hard part's punching through the flies to get to him. But I mean, hey. Yeah, so. Not too hard for a boss. But I mean. This would definitely be the ideal boss to start with. And then, if you want to win, then you gotta break all these flies too. That one shoots blood everywhere. It's kind of gross, I guess. And Jesus juice. So now, for luck, we have higher range so Jesus jewels and we also shoot farther too because it said range up so now our guy looks weird we'll see where telepose takes us oh great takes us right to the boss now peep is interesting because he just pisses all over the place I suppose makes sense considering his name has P in it. Again, a rather easy boss to face. Ah. Uh, all over the room and then his eyes just pop out or whatever and start floating around dropping blood all over the place so that's fun oh god that was close and that's one of the risks of telepills is that sometimes it'll teleport you straight to the boss room. And then there are other times that it oh ouch takes you to the item room or uh, self sacrifice room or some other room. Sometimes it'll take you to the secret room, I think. Now, this one's fun. This is Squeezy. Um, so now we'll be shooting faster, I believe. Yeah. So now we're shooting really fast, I think. I don't know, my computer's slow. Ooh, fun. I really don't like these worm things. They just kind of squirt blood all over the place. Ooh, a penny! Ooh. Oh god. This is bad. Champion meat blob. You can tell he's a champion because his things are bigger. And he's, and he's bigger than he dropped tarot card. Sixth Sun. I don't know what that does. I probably just wasted it. Oh, no. It shows us... Oh, I get it. That's cool. Now we can see the entire layout of this level. Which is similar to the compass, except it shows us actually all the rooms instead of just where the special rooms are.
These guys are I don't like because you kill them and then they fall down into that goop. And then you gotta kill the goop. So this is our starting room. We don't need to go down there. We need a bomb to get to the secret room. Uh shoot. It'd be really nice to have some bombs. But hey, beggars can't be choosers. Not that I am a beggar. These things just kind of float around, and, but when you kill them, they explode into blood all over the place, and it's gross and nasty. Ah. Uh, like that. They make a lovely noise, too. <laughs> so we'll just see what's in here. Just a goop guy. So, shouldn't be too hard. And a key. That's great that we have keys. But, oh, wait, no, that's a self sacrifice room, not a blood bank, I guess. If you want to call it that. I'll just go in here. And then what do we have? Guppy's tail. Hmm. I do not know what that does. But I suppose we may eventually find out. You never know. These things are called hives. They're like mini dukes of flies, I guess, but not that bad really. Because they only spit out one or two flies at a time. A nickel. Ooh, Monstro's Tooth. So if we do that, then a little Monstro. It's another one of the bosses. Will come and come and stomp on everything. I guess. But I still don't have any bombs. I'd really like to get in that secret room. But hey, whatever. Mm, there's a penny, two pins actually. I don't need pennies, but I do want this heart. That heart would be nice, very nice, indeed. Look at the heart. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can go to the shop now. Let's see. Oh, speak a witch. There's a compass and a bomb. Maybe we'll just buy a key too. Uh, where was it that there was something that I wanted? I think it was in this next room here. Was it? No. It was down a ways. Okay. Yeah. So if you put bombs next to the rocks around the What are they called? The little holes in the ground? Like this. Like how this rock's here and there's this hole here. If I put a bomb here, it'll... Oh. Damn it. Okay, never mind. That was a waste of a bomb. Well, usually it knocks it into the hole and you can walk across, but I guess not. So, whatever. Again, beggars can't be choosers. Be nice to be able to be a chooser, but you can't always have what you want. So we'll just hop down here. And the caves, too. So if you look now on our map, we can see where the item, the boss, and that sword thing is, uh, 
a what you call it room. Uh, mob room, I guess. What? The technology. Oh, nice. So now we shoot laser tears. Okay. I'm cool with laser tears. Um. Not really sure what the purpose of that room was. Actually. Um. Hmm. That's kind of cool. Yeah. And, uh. Let's see how this thing works. Oh god. Shoot. Ooh, a treasure chest. Mom's lipstick. Delicious. That's fun. Take out everything in a line. I do not understand what they're doing. It's just a thing of blowy things up. Ooh, corn poop. Delicious. So now we have six cents, two bombs, and a coin. Or, sorry, key. We have a key. So I'm not sure if maybe the secret room is here. No, shoot. Okay. All right, not too bad. Just. Wasted a bomb, is all. Oh god. <laughs> mm, mm, no, 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 dang it. Ah, no! No! Alright, well, I died, and I was not killed by a headless baby, I was killed by a spider. Alright guys, so, that's the Binding of Isaac, um, you should probably expect some more videos of the Binding of Isaac from me, uh, possibly from Tommy, if and when he eventually gets fraps. I will be getting a computer, like an actual gaming PC, sometime soon. So you can expect some higher quality graphics and better games and stuff, such as Daisy, Saints Row the Third, Borderlands, etc and same usual games uh... you know minecraft and binding of isaac and might start playthrough of the baking which i've played some already and some other games i don't know i don't know something and uh... yeah so that's the binding of isaac peoples so again, I've been I well, was is will be Nico still and always from Dwarf Games. So I will well no, I'm not gonna say it, but I will be making more videos soon. You guys will watch them, hopefully you will like them. Uh you don't have to like them or favorite them but, or comment on them even, but if you want to or you feel like you should then please do. But no pressure. So, Binding of Isaac. Fun game. If you want, you can buy it on Steam. You should know how to find it. 
so I'm not gonna link it in the description. I'm not gonna link anything in the description. Because I don't have to. Anyway, yeah, fun. Binding of Isaac. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.